I'm gonna tell you why these cars don't see us motorcycle riders when they nail one of us. And that's the first thing they say if they nail one of us. They say, you know, officer, I didn't see the motorcycle rider. You know why there's a, a scientific reason as to why they don't see us and what we should be doing to educate these car drivers to help prevent from nailing one of us motorcycle riders. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. Yeah, that's, you know, when cars nail us, you know, when they nail one of us bikers, that's the first thing they say. They didn't see the biker. But there is a scientific reason as to why they don't see us. And it's called sarcadic masking. My bad, it's pronounced saccadic masking. And basically what that is applies to what car drivers is when they're scanning the road to see which cars are coming. You know, they do it too fast. They look too quickly. And really your mind cannot process what you see in a seamless motion. Basically what it's doing is it's taking quick snapshots and then it's filling in the rest with recent memory. So you can have, you can end up with a blind spot. So that's the reason why they may not see you. And how they can correct that and what this should be taught, which it may be taught now, I don't know, in, in uh, driving course classes, is to take your time when you're looking, when you're scanning the road as a car driver and as a motorcycle rider. Same thing can happen to a motorcycle rider. If you scan the road too quickly and your mind's not catching everything really, like I said, it takes snapshots as you're looking around and it's filling in the rest with recent memory and it can create a, a blind spot. If you notice a lot of times before I make my turns, I always look twice. I take my time, I look to the left, slowly scan to the right, then I'll look again and then scan to the right. I'll do it twice, but do it slow, take your time. And that's why I tell you guys to use your horn. Like I said, take that to the, take that to the track. Just make sure he knows, he knows. Yeah, yeah, I'm here, baby. Because when they can't see you, at least they can hear you. That's why I've been honking at every car that I pass that's waiting to make a turn. And I always pay attention, not all the time, because but I, I look in the driver's eyes and I see that they're not really paying attention to me. I'm gonna get their attention either with my throttle or my horn. That's something you definitely want to do. And you know, now that I learned about this new reason why cars do not see us motorcycle riders, this sarcadic masking. Psychotic. It's definitely having me honk the horn before I pass these cars. Because I want them to, if they can't see me, I want them to hear me. So take your time, that's the key here, take your time when you're scanning the road as a car driver. Take your time. Now I know you motorcycle riders out there, you probably are very cautious because I'll tell you being a motorcycle rider has actually made me a more cautious car driver. It has made me a better car driver. I especially watch out for motorcycle riders most definitely. But see like this car is getting ready to make a turn here. I let him know, but I saw him, he was looking at me. Definitely want to pay attention to these, if they're looking at you or not. But take your time when you're scanning the road, when you're getting ready to make your turns. Like I said, even as a motorcycle rider, take your time, let these cars pass. Wait till the road is 100% clear before you make that turn. And like I said, slowly look, slowly pay attention, pause, look for a while, then slowly scan over to the right. I said you don't want to do that quick stuff. Like I said, the sarcadic masking is just taking snapshots and filling in the rest with recent memory. And it could be missing out that motorcycle rider that's coming. 
and uh, it could set that motorcycle rider for a real effed up day if you decide to pull out on them see I'm taking my time I don't care how long it takes I'm taking my time before I make that turn I'm in no rush and if I had to be somewhere quickly I mean if I'm late to where I'm supposed to be then oh well I'm just late better be late than to end up dead <laughs> you know uh, under a bridge gonna get some exhaust action ah, I love doing it <laughs> that's the douchebag in me man but I love hearing that exhaust dude gotta do it gotta do it dude <laughs> gotta do it sounds so awesome awesome take your time boy but anyways I thought I'd just share that tidbit with you guys if you some of you probably did understand you know why cars say they don't see us and honestly factually they're really not seeing us like I said because of sarcadic masking psychotic so there you go so let's educate our car drivers to take their time when scanning the road don't do those quick head scans because it could set a biker up for a real effed up day but that's all I have for you guys hey if you want to get my gear uh, I always include links to my gear in the description and comment section of this video by the way I got some new duds I got a new uh, black and high viz jacket got a new helmet got a new no drag backpack high viz help me be seen out here on the streets and also you can get my gear at my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab my gear and that is uh, links to all of my current gear there you can get and if you want to see more of my videos click on the menu tab my videos and those are playlists to all of my videos to help you navigate through them easy. I have actually one playlist called safety videos that give you some safety tips to help keep you safe out here on the streets. And this dude's got high, high beams on the back of me and it's really irritating, man. But, hey guys, hit thumbs up if you like this video. Share this video with your friends because it may just help save a biker's life. I appreciate all you guys. Take care. Subscribe to my All The One Motorcycle channel. So until next time. Hey, don't forget to check out my other YouTube channel that features the original bug out moto van that is designed and built by yours truly so that I can live in my van with my motorcycle. So hey, check me out at youtube.com forward slash bug out moto. Subscribe today.